From 41 Action News, a major announcement about a plan to bring economic stimulus to the urban core. Richard Sharp was there as the plan was unveiled this morning. Richard. Yeah, several different community groups were on hand at this church as the plan was unveiled. The plan they want to put on the ballot. Now, if they can do it and if it passes, it will bring $8 million of community stimulus, economic stimulus to this area, the urban core. These groups today say they have enough signatures gathered to put the tax on the ballot for April. It would be a sales tax of eighth of a percent. That's basically less than 1% of your bill when you go to buy something. The whole city would pay the tax, but the money generally generated would only be for the urban core a specific district. So this could be a tough sell for the rest of the city to pass, but the group says they have voted for every other tax plan that has benefited other parts of the city and it's time for the favor to be returned. The people east of Truce have consistently made these investments, but we have been consistently denied investments, equitable investments in our community. And for others who may be the naysayers or, or things like that, well, don't talk about our community and what's so wrong with it if you're not helping to support the efforts right. that can improve it. We need the kind of economic injection that will help the core to be successful, to develop the kind of environment where there can be success. All right, let's take a look at a map here to kind of show you how big this district will be. It'll be bordered on the north by 9th Street, Gregory to the south, Paseo on the east, and Indiana on the west. It is a big one. It's expected to foster everything from small businesses to grocery scores to vocational schools and more. So the group says they have enough signatures. They're taking those signatures to the city clerk to turn them in to get this on the ballot this afternoon. Live in Kansas City, I'm Richard Sharp, 41 Action News.